Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I've got an iHeart Revolution makeup collection video for you. I'm gonna be looking at the new Shrek and Revolution makeup collection. I think it's adorable. I absolutely adore Shrek and when I saw they were doing a makeup collection, I was like, what? I've picked up quite a bit of the collection. I haven't got all of it. I just picked the things up that I really liked the look of. What I'm gonna do is an unboxing video in this video and then I'm gonna be doing testing videos for each of these items. So if you want to see that, then please subscribe. When I looked at the collection online I did see that they had quite a lot of eyeshadow palettes. There was a lot to choose from. I'm just going to show you bits and bobs here. I did get the entire lipstick range from this Shrek and Revolution collection so I'll show you those. I got a couple of mini palettes as well and I got the Fiona palette and then the Dreamworks just overall palette as well. The first item which I picked up in the Shrek and iHeart Revolution collection was this massive eyeshadow palette. This one's called the iHeart Revolution Happily Ever After shadow palette. It was a big one in the collection. They had a couple of big ones. They had one that looked like a Shrek head <laughs> and then they had this one and I tell you this one really screamed out to me. The colours I'll show you in a second are absolutely beautiful and they're very me. <laughs> This is what the box looks like of the Happily Ever After shadow palette. You've got all the characters on the front there. And then on the back, you've got some more artwork from the film. And you've got a little preview of what the eyeshadow palette looks like as well. I think the packaging on this is absolutely just perfect. It really does represent the film well. And I'm really excited to show you. This is what the eyeshadow palette itself looks like. It's a very big one. It's actually got 30 pans in here. So it does say some of them are pressed pigments. And I'll just show you up close. This is what it looks like. It just mimics the box and you've got the lovely gold shiny title on there and then on the back you've got the characters and then the little preview with the pans on as well and I really love the packaging I think it's beautiful <laughs> and you've got a Shrek shaped mirror which I am all here for I love that and then looking at the eyeshadow palette itself this is absolutely beautiful there's a couple of Shrek colours in there there's the fairy godmother princess colours the pinks you've got neutral tones there's a very good ratio of matte to shimmers in here I think this section over over here is shouting my name and then I am loving that little green down there because I haven't got something like that in my collection and because obviously this is a Shrek collection you'd expect to see some greens. I absolutely love the look of this I think they're all stunning. As I said I will be doing testing videos on all of the items in this video and I do upload daily at the moment so these videos will be going out one after the other so if you want to see swatches of any of these items they will be in those individual videos. The next eyeshadow palette in the Shrek and iHeart Revolution collection is this medium sized sort of of chocolate bar sized eyeshadow palette. It's called By Day One Way By Night Another and it's got Fiona in princess form and then Fiona in princess Shrek form which is so cute and it's got that little moving sort of holographic, I've forgotten the name of it, thing on the front which is very nostalgic because I remember things like Tazos and it just brings back a lot of cute memories so I really like the look of this one. This one's about the same size as a normal iHeart Revolution chocolate bar palette. It's really going to fit well in your collection if you you do collect eye heart makeup. This has got green packaging around the outside and then you've obviously got your holographic image on the front which I haven't seen in a palette before so I think that's cool. Inside you've got a full size palette size mirror and then these are what the shades look like. I absolutely love this colour story. It's such a chaotic <laughs> kind of thing. The pinks were definitely what called my name when I was looking at this palette because there's five pink tones in here. You've got the hot Barbie pink and then the baby pinks. You've got this cool tone in the middle here, the gold, the green up here and the blue as well. I think all of these look absolutely stunning and I'm very excited to give this a go. I think when I was looking at the collection I was really attracted to this one just because it's so unusual. If you collect makeup and you just wanted to get one little thing from the range this looks like a cute one. Those were my two bigger palettes from the Shrek Revolution collection. As I said there was another one which was a Shrek shaped eyeshadow palette and really there was a lot of eyeshadow palettes in this collection so I had to just pick the ones that I really like the look of and that's what I did. Next up I've got a couple of mini palettes. In the collection there were four mini shadow palettes I do believe. The only ones I didn't get was the Lord Farquaad one and then the Donkey one. I did pick these two up though. The first one I'll show you is the Puss in Boots mini eyeshadow palette. I mean look at the packaging. <laughs> It's so cute and it's a very very small palette so if you've had the chocolate bar minis it's kind of like the same size as those I would say it's smaller than your palm but it's really travel size and the colour in this was so cute so I had to get it. This is what the packaging looks like you've got a Puss in Boots image then you've got the little preview there on the back it just shows you it's got eight shadows in there and it's just a really cute size I love it. Out the box the palette looks like this it just opens in book form as normal and it's kind of like a 
cardboard texture, but it's a really strong one. On the front, you've got the little kitty. And then on the back, you've got the three blind mice as well, which is cute. It's just called the Puss in Boots Shadow Palette. It says four matte and four shimmer shades. Inside, you've got the little mirror. And it says wanna cuddle in the middle. <laughs> and the actual palette has the design of the fur of the Puss in Boots on it as well, which is really cute. Just showing you the palette up close now. As you'll see in the top, you've got a real attention to detail. You've got the P signature that Puss in Boots writes on things. And then you've got four mats on the top and four shimmers at the bottom. And the names are really cute. I love I Hot Revolution's attention to detail and that gold fur ball colour at the bottom. That looks so pretty. As I said, I will be doing testing videos with all of the individual items. So if you want to see the swatches of the Puss in Boots mini palette and a testing video, then please subscribe. The final little mini palette that I've got in the Shrek collection is this one here and then I'll get on with the lipsticks. This is the Need a Hero mini shadow palette. Again it's got four mattes in it and four shimmers. This is what the box looks like and this is what the actual eyeshadow palette looks like. On the front you've got Fairy Godmother <laughs> and then you've got a lovely red packaging and you've got her son Prince Charming on the back as well. I think the attention to detail is so lovely. On the spine of this eyeshadow palette it says deep fat fried and smothered in chocolate. I just think everything in this collection is so well thought out and if you're a Shrek fan you're really going to appreciate the little details. I love it. Inside you've got a little mirror and the eyeshadow palette itself is one of the prettiest I've seen launched this year, I swear. This is so pretty. I've not seen a blue like that before and I have to say I was imagining the Eye Hot Revolution Elsa palette to look like that and it really screamed out to me so I had to get this one. This was actually the first one that I popped in my basket. In the top four matte shades you've got an impressed print of the Fairy Godmother's Wand and then down here you've got four beautiful beautiful shimmers. I am so excited to try this one out. I think all of the mini palettes in this collection had a really good character theme and I'm very glad I picked these two up because these were the two that I really liked the look of. Finally we've got the I Heart Revolution Shrek lipstick collection. I did pick up all four of these. I'll show you the boxes now. We've got a donkey lipstick, a dragon lipstick, Fiona and Gingy and I just think they're so cute. So there's something special about the Fiona one which I will show you shortly and I think the package is absolutely beautiful. For any collector out there, these are just so sweet. They did actually sell out very quickly and I think they've had a restock now, but looking at the shades, I just thought they're really, really nice shades and very usable and I wanted to get all four of them just for my collection. First of all, I'll show you my favourite one. So this one is the Lip Balm, which is colour changing. It's Fiona's. I think they called it a transformation lipstick because of the pH changing function to it. It's got the really cute details on the packaging and <laughs> <laughs> that one made me laugh and it's just a really nice design. Inside the lipsticks are not like anything I've seen before. The closest shape I've seen to this were the chocolate bar lipsticks but this looks very different to what I Heart Revolution normally do. It's a gold packaging and then you've got the Fiona sort of green logo embossed on it and it just feels really nice. I really like it. Inside this is the transformation lipstick. As soon as I saw this I wanted to get it. I didn't even look at the other lipsticks for ages after I saw this one because I thought of all the ones I want to get from a collection it is this and it's just absolutely beautiful it's proper Shrek fantasy theme I just love it so much swatch wise I've just popped some on my hand there just for a preview for you and pH changing lipsticks really excite me I just did a Lottie London testing video as well with their Halloween vampire diaries lipstick and just look at that that pink is absolutely stunning we'll be doing a testing videos with all these lipsticks the next one I picked up was the gingy lipstick this is what the box looks like and then on top it's got a swatch shade for you. The actual lipstick itself is one of the cutest I have in this collection. It's got little gingerbread men on it and then it's a nice orange colour. Inside you've got gold details and then you've got this beautiful red lipstick. It's actually a matte one from the look of it this one. On the swatches on the website I just thought this is so unusual. I've not seen anything like that and it'll be really good to have in my collection to go with red eyeshadow looks and things. The next one I picked up was the donkey one. For me I thought this was the most wearable shade it was absolutely stunning. This is what the packaging looks like and he's so happy and cheerful. He's so innocent, isn't he? He's so cute. The swatch on the top looks like that. And then the actual lipstick itself is in this kind of concrete colour and it's got a very happy, cheerful donkey on the outside. And then inside you've got this beautiful nude. And it's definitely one you could wear daily for work. I can't wait to test these out in a testing video and I hope you look forward to seeing it. The last lipstick I got in the Shrek and iHeart Revolution collection is the Dragon Lipstick. I 
really love the packaging on this one. I think all of these items really capture the characters really well. This is what the swatch looks like on top. The actual lipstick itself is this stunning crimson and gold colour. And I think all of these lipsticks stood next to each other will look so good in your collection. And they'll be really good to use for videos as well for myself. This is what the shade looks like. It's a perfect Christmas red. That's what I thought when I saw it. And it's just a really nice colour. Really sums up the character. And again, the packaging, it just looks amazing. Those were the four lipsticks in the Shrek I Heart Revolution collection. As I said, I will be doing a separate testing video for the lipsticks as well as using them in the eyeshadow palette testing videos. So if you want to see the lipsticks specifically, then keep an eye out for that video. I'm just going to show you a little recap of everything I got from the Shrek and I Heart Revolution collection. This was the Happily Ever After eyeshadow palette with 30 pans inside. You've got the beautiful Shrek mirror and these are what the eyeshadow pans look like. I got the by day one way by night another eyeshadow palette and these are what the pans look like just a note as well the names are really funny and they're very well thought out <laughs> and I really like that I also got the Puss in Boots mini eyeshadow palette which is a neutral autumnal kind of palette with a couple of Christmassy shimmers in there which I really like the Need a Hero mini eyeshadow palette or the Fairy Godmother palette which some people are calling it it's got a very glittery inside and these are what the pans look like the Fiona Transformation lip balm the Dragon Lipstick, the Gingy Lipstick, I really love the packaging on this one. And then finally the Donkey Lipstick, which is a beautiful brown nude. That was everything in my Shrek and I Hot Revolution collection video. I am so excited by this collection. I genuinely think it's so well done and all of the characters are really sort of displaying in the items here and I love that. I love that they brought out a little lipstick collection and the array of eyeshadow palettes in this collection is astonishing. There are loads. There's loads to choose from. There's something for everybody. If you don't want to get one of the bigger ones, you can get a little one and I just think they're very well thought out. I really, really like this collection. I am genuinely so excited to test this out that is what I'm going to do straight after this video so if you want to see all of these items tested then please subscribe because they will be going up one after the other and genuinely this collection makes me smile so much if you want to see more then you can follow me on instagram that's at zoe glitter zoe with a y and I'll see you in the next video bye